This video is going to show you how to set up the self-service password reset which allows you to reset your school password from home. The first thing that you've got to do is go to the website that is shown on the screen at the moment. I've also put a link to this in the video description. So that should then bring up a page that looks similar to this one. At this point you need to type in your school email address. So this will be your username followed by at Arthur Terry dot bham dot sch dot uk if you don't know your username then you need to email inquiry at arthur terry dot bham dot sch dot uk um, from another email account and ask for your username you'll then be prompted to type in your password obviously if you don't know this again you need to email the address that i've previously mentioned You'll then be asked whether or not you want to stay signed in. This is a personal choice, um, depending whether you're using a public computer or not. It will depend on whether you decide to tick yes or no. That should bring up a page that looks similar to this. If you've never set up any um, self-service password reset options before, you should have four exclamation marks, as you can see here. The one that we recommend using for students is the security questions. Click on set them up now and you'll be presented with a screen that looks like this. Decide which three questions you would like to select and then type in the answers to those questions. Once that's completed, press Save Answers and this will change to a green tick and you'll be able to tick or click Finish. So, once you've done that, this will now mean that when you go to office.com and click on Sign In, if you have forgotten your password you'll be able to click on can't access your account you'll then be able to select that this is a school account and you'll be able to type in your user ID which is your email address there may be a capture question here for you to fill in and then you press next that will then give you those three questions that you selected previously once you've typed those in correctly and press next you will then be able to change to a new password and click finish. This will then allow you to access your school account.